it was in the middle of the Easter weekend. We had people traveling away from home. It was just two, three weeks before Cinco de Mayo, major holiday for, uh, for those brands. So my first reaction, not now. The first step was to convene with the crisis team to make sure to, that we had all the key people around the table uh, and, and get as much information as possible. One of the key things that you find while going through the recall is that on one side, you would like to have more time to learn more. We have an international supply chain. The product is coming out of Mexico. There's a lot of steps in between. At the same time, for the sake of consumers, you want to move as fast as possible. And if something serious is happening, you want to, to make sure it doesn't reach the consumer. Um, so the key thing is to get organized and start learning as fast as possible what's going on, where's the product, etc. So we had our sales employees across the country reaching out to the distributor partners with the product code so we knew exactly what needed to be pulled back. And it was all hands on deck. It was our distributor partners, their employees, it was our employees, it was our employees' families, all working hand in hand to get that product pulled out of retail. And in the end, what a triumph, 96% of the product was pulled back and really all a testament to the hard work of all of those parties. Social media these days are, are everywhere and ever present. And we were very conscious that we had to handle that in a proactive way um, also given that the brand in question, Dos Equis, is a huge brand in, uh, in the social space. Um, so we, we took that in two ways. We literally had the brand director of the Dos Equis brand as part of the crisis team. And he was personally in the room for, during the first one or two weeks, reacting instantly to the posts that consumers were leaving on our Facebook sites, in Twitter, and on, on YouTube. An important thing to note is that we benefited from learnings of those who had similar crises in, in the past. And we did look at how Sam Adams handled their recall situation at the time, and we learned a lot from it. Our distributor partners were phenomenal through the process. What a gold standard for the consumer in terms of being able to quickly identify, quickly go to retail and pull back potentially affected product. The three-tier system has been uh, extremely important and very instrumental in this particular case. Um, to recover so much product that was spread out of so many different states, over so many different distributors, so many different points of uh, retail, to be able to rely on our distributor network to recover so much product that quickly uh, has, has been very, very impressive.